High school side of the ball, there are some good rivalries later tonight, but we know of one on the collegiate side too, right here at home in Memorial State, and this is what it's going to look like tomorrow evening as a lot of Colorado fans try to make it in, but we hope uh, to see this Sea of Red just kind of take over tomorrow night with kickoff at 630 against Colorado. Primetime under the nut lights. I hesitate to say primetime because we know the name of that coach, but temperatures are going to be prime as well. Temperatures falling to the lower 70s by 6 o'clock and around kickoff. And then as the sun sets, again, kind of similar to what we're going to see tonight for uh, the Friday night lights. Temperatures falling through the 60s and lower 60s, closer to the end of the game with southeast winds in around 5 to 10 miles per hour. So maybe needing a hoodie jacket for the end of the game not so much for the beginning of the game while the sun's still out because it, it gets cold once the sun goes down or even if you're in the shade on days like today because you'll certainly feel it with a little light northerly breeze. Beautiful glow though as we take a live look outside our Friday morning of our Barry Law Tower camera. Clear skies for the most part looking that way. So temperatures falling to the 50s. 53 now here at the Lincoln Airport as well as toward Omaha at Epley. 51 in the northeast corner of the state in Norfolk and central Nebraska seeing 50s as well if not uh, right around 50 degrees in North Platte. In fact, uh, even Chadron warmed up a little bit since uh, checking in on them last hour when they'd fallen to 49 degrees. Not much going on in satellite. We had seen some mid-level clouds develop overnight in north central Nebraska, now producing just a light shower or two in and around Ord, headed toward Loop City between uh, St. Paul as well. Not going to produce a whole lot of rain. Consider yourself lucky if this hits your backyard because a lot of us are waiting on the rain and we could really use it, but a lot of us are going to miss out on even this uh, scarce round that we're going to see kind of develop throughout the later morning hours as well. It'll shift a little bit to the east. I think Lincoln will stay dry and we'll see those clouds even clear by this evening for kickoff for those high school games and then a fairly clear night tonight as well as the sun's going down. So for a high temperature today, 77 doesn't get much better than that at this time of the year with low dew points, low humidity should be a comfortable day ending out this work week with north winds around 5 to 15 miles per hour. And I say we could really use the rain because we could. We're seeing further areas of drought develop. In fact, southern Lancaster County now in the moderate category category for some drought development. You see northwest corner of the state isn't doing too hot either, so we could really use the rain. Unfortunately, even looking farther out through the middle portion of this month, we're leaning towards below average precipitation and toward a warmer uh, kind of section of the month as well, leading towards above average temperatures, especially across northeast Nebraska, but for much of Nebraska as well. So we'll enjoy 70s for not only today, but also tomorrow, topping out around 76 degrees during the afternoon. Of course, there's a lot of Husker events going on tomorrow, so a great day to be out in the town before we do look warmer for a majority of next week as 90s are in the forecast for just about every every day until next weekend.